Welcome to Zero Page Homebrew After Dark, <laughs> <laughs> where we play extended versions of games that we've seen on the show that we want to put some extra time into. It's a more relaxed mm -hmm. atmosphere. The cats are relaxed. We've turned off, we've turned off one of the lights. <laughs> Fall down. Turned off one of the lights. Yeah. Oh! Oh, that was barely on. And it's Jaguar After Dark. So let's take down that 2600 from the previous stream and get the Jaguar sign up. Let me grab it out of here. I feel like this needs more batteries. I'm not sure it's even on. Oh, yeah, it's on. Is or it? maybe not. It's, I don't know. It's pretty, uh... Let's put up the Jaguar Ew! sign. Oh my god, how beautiful is that? It Have you is. put that up before? Oh yeah. Really? Yep. Oh, it is. It is you sexy. You go down. You're That's a sexy Jaguar on. sign. I it like It is, that a lot. and I asked the developer, uh, the, um... Right next person to who Bernie. made that sure. that about yeah a lynx one he doesn't have a lynx one so he's so you thinking said, about it making why a not one. make me you know make me a lynx one make please me a lynx and one. i would buy it the, the time, time has come, come. <laughs> it had the time has come to play some more games we're yeah. gonna be playing two games one's a I'm demo so though and mm -hmm. i thought oh i'd pair it um with this jaguar because i um oh um, because it's, it's just a demo, so it won't take too long to get through it, I don't mm -hmm. think. Um, so we are going to be playing Jumping at Shadows. Hey! No, I'm <laughs> responding to Dan. The Fuji in the sign is amazing. Yeah, it's very, very clever. It's a beautiful sign. I'm gonna, very impressed. We're going to be playing Jumping at Shadows by okay. Reboot. Uh, uh, Lawrence Stavely, Cyrano J, who's in the chat, I think, mm -hmm. still. Mm -hmm. um, and we'll... It gives more information about that when we get into it. And uh, we're also going to be playing Stormbringer <gasps> Retail Release. I'm so excited. Um, which was offered at PRGE and is now for sale. Is it? In the Atari Age store. <gasps> he did release the Jaguar Ooh. games. Oh, those are, those are ready so to those go. Are ready to so, go. Jaguar fans. If you like this, you see, yeah. like what you see, they're available yeah. right now. Uh, this cat is not available. There's only one, Aww. and uh, we've got the original copy of it. Yeah. <laughs> if you want a DNA clone of him, well, maybe we can send you. We like, can work something. A little, a little piece of fur, something. something like that. Yeah, yeah, a little cat's bed. Yeah. He, he, he'll, he'll give some cat's bed. Yeah. <laughs> Thinking of about Blondie songs, Atomic Blonde. Yeah. <laughs> all, all the Blondie, Blonde stuff. All the Blondie. Um. Good old so... Debbie Harry. Let's just uh, let's just get into it. I think. Oh yeah yeah yeah. yeah. Bring it on. Um, oh, let me plug in a Jaguar controller. I, th I think I put them all back. Mm -hmm. Do you want the thumbstick or do you want the D-pad? I'll try the thumbstick. I was doing just the D-pad before. I'm. And the, the thumbstick. Well, if you myself. want it, I'll take the D-pad. I'm fine. No, I was I don't playing. Want you to. No, it's all good. No, I want you to do the thumbstick. You don't like the thumbstick? I like the thumbstick. I want you to do the thumbstick. Well, I don't care. You pick what you want to <laughs> well, use. I'm going to pick the one I like. Yeah. Yeah. Are we switching back and forth? We're not both playing, so. No, we're not. Yeah. It's all good. <laughs> You're confusing me. No. You're like trying you... to convince me to not. No, I thought for a second we were both playing. At... Oh, fight, no. fight, fight, fight. <laughs> uh, we were both playing. I'm like, grab whatever you want. Rawr, I'm okay. Ha I'm happy either way. Because when we played uh, the Jaguar the other day, it was with the D-pad. Oh, so. it sounds like you're trying to convince me out of uh, picking the thing I want. No, no, no. I'm like, let's get the thumbstick. No, no. no, you should pick what you want. I'm like, that's what I'm doing. No, I thought you were giving me... Oh, two different controls. You're like, you take one, I take the other. And I'm like... Confusion. And then, then all of a sudden I realized, no, the, none of these are two-player games. So, no, well, I don't know this. about the demo. I, I See, that's I the thing. I don't so. know about the demo, but... I don't think so. No. Oh, you exactly are so cute. Demo, yeah. So these cats, through the break, completely vacated the room. Of course. And the moment they hear the dun-dun, dun-dun, <laughs> both that's cats come cue. running into the room like... Ding, 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 tree time? I don't know. <laughs> maybe. We'll see. <laughs> uh, well, uh, maybe we can learn a little bit about the uh, Jaguar as we play it. Yeah. Um, so let me uh, <laughs> get this going up. So here you go. Yeah. And we'll switch over in one second. There we go. Jumping at shadows. I made a little uh, nice. uh, cartridge for it. Load uh, that it's a ROM. Load it good. a uh, Meg game. Uh, yeah. We're loading it off the Jaguar game drive. 
So it is by uh, the group known as Reboot. And in this case, it is... Oh, let me turn it up here. Is there a roar? There was. We missed it. Damn, I missed the roar. It's the best part of the jagu Jaguar is the roar at the roar. beginning. It's a pretty cool system. It is a system I knew nothing about until this show. Reboot. Work in progress. Wow. Wait, wait. Are you pressing buttons? No, I haven't touched anything. Oh my anything. god, that was quick. No, no, it did that. Oh. I, he blames me. Sometimes you he do. He blames me. I don't touch things because I know. <laughs> yeah, we want to like, see. We want to see everything here. Yeah. Yeah. Low on bytes. <laughs> I like the thumbstick I added to my Repro Pro controller. Yeah. yeah. I can't find my Pro control. Maybe I haven't. I don't think I've put... What are you eating? <laughs> that cuts. Oh, I don't think I've put a thumbstick cut. on the Pro controller. I, I need to, though. Um, low Jaguar. on bites. Oh, for feeding the yeah. cat. Jaguar, oh, as the Brits say. Yeah. It's the fumes are starting to get touchy. Touchy. <laughs> the only time I've ever heard somebody say touchy is on uh, a Red Dwarf. Touchy? Yes. Who says touchy on, on Red Dwarf? They made Red a Dwarf? joke about the word touchy. Oh. Um, Crichton uh, doesn't like the word touchy. And it makes him mad. Or he was making somebody else mad oh, with the really? word tetchy. It was very funny. Never, ever heard anybody ever except there, there, and on the show. So funny. <laughs> tetchy, tetchy, tetchy. Yeah. Um, okay. Jumping at Shadows <laughs> made by Reboot. Lawrence Stavely, Ander Lex, uh, Eric D45 for the sound engine. Sorry, Ander Lex and uh, Lawrence Stavely for the code. Uh, Ander Lex and uh, Zdaz D Art for the artwork. And Roald Strauss for the music. Uh, so this is an original game. As far as I know, Cyrano can correct me, because I believe they only put the name Reboot on their original games. Mm -hmm. And for the games that they're porting over... Yes, it's original. Excellent. For the games they're porting over, they don't put the Reboot name because, well, it's somebody else's game. Okay, fair and, enough. Yeah. But they do credit the people who worked on it. So Jump Against Shadows, PRG 2022 demo. This was uh, for demo at PRG if you went there unfortunately we had zero time to do anything no, other than interview and sleep that. yeah um, <laughs> depends true. how many Jaguars they have set up and they have multiple games sometimes yeah. so people pop them in and out mm -hmm. An Adventure Through Darkness by L. Stavely and Alex which Lex? Alex mm -hmm. um, press B to play you got a nice little robot zero out of one oh, and zero God, somethings beautiful. rise up from the ashes oh it is gorgeous so what are my controls here? Let me get the volumes going, because I can't oh. hear anything. There we go. Um, there were no instructions, as far as I could tell, in the forums. So it might be like, learn as you go. Okay. B? I'm Laura. Very happy to meet you. You, you don't have to read it all. Well, somebody has to read it. <laughs> Because that's what you do. Learning. My full name is Learning Analytical Upgraded Robot Assistant, but that is a bit of a mouthful, so please use the shorter version. Laura, I will try to assist you on your journey. Good luck. Because if we just sit here and go stare at the screen with silence, Press it's the three button at the right crate to drop a bomb and blow it up. Be careful and don't hurt yourself. Move away a short distance. Okay. So I see so zero So what is the one. three? The, that? Oh. Oh. Like the literal like three. Like literal button. three. Oh, that's cool. Go to the crate. Go back. Press the three. That's not a crate, is it? Looks like a crate to me. Oh, nothing in it. <gasps> now got some I sort can't of complete portal. the game. Just kidding. <laughs> some sort of portal there as well. Ernie! Oh, Ernie and Lara. Oh, wait. That, that. My longer name is Electronic Robot Neural Interface Enhancer, but nobody remembers that. Just come here, Ernie, friend. Oh, cute. You can double jump to get higher ledges. Do this, press the B to jump, and then B again while jumping. You can also push down to fall through the ledges or drop off the moving platforms. You're far better at moving than me. <laughs> Before I forget, you can also fire energy bursts by pushing the C button. Be careful, uh, things are not as they seem. So you've got a jump and a fire. Okay. Well, doing doubles already. Oh, geez, now I can't fall. Oh, oh, you can fall back through by going down. Yeah. Um, what did they say? The C button? C oh, I see. C for firing. Gotcha. Okay. And then, and then three drops the bomb. Advert jail over. Oh no. Three shots on that guy. 
Nice. Gorgeous looking um, screens. They look really, really nice. Um, and that would be uh, Anderlex and SASD Art. <gasps> this is a beautiful game. Yeah, there's a little siren there. Oh, a little nope. bit too high to get up there. So in the forums it says, uh, with Gravit Gravitic Minds complete, we haven't been sitting around mm. partying all day. Really? Here's a peek into what Reboot Games has been working on. This is from February. Once more into the breach, dear friends. This is a tech demonstration of work in progress and an mm. upcoming reboot. It's a work in progress. This is so beautiful. Yeah. Tentatively oh. called Jumping at Shadows. <gasps> like, I can't believe this is on original hardware. Yeah. This, this is, is this gorgeous. Is... This is something you would... <laughs> you would buy for a new... Buy on Steam. It's exactly. just beautiful. Uh, we're a long a way from the job. finish line. Okay. Let's no, no. Finish. I will speak for Laura. You can speak for Ernie. Okay. Okay. <laughs> but things are progressively smoothly. Progressing smoothly. Okay. Okay. This is a portal, and it is the end of this zone. Collect the fusion orb over there to open it, and you can get out of here. Nice. I'll turn up the sound a little bit. Oh, be the shining light from the shadows. Okay, here's Lurie. Thank you, Sarah Noje. Just let me know if any of the sound audio is very levels quiet. are off. Yeah. Yeah, just turned it up. Yeah. Beautiful game. Okay. It features fluid 60 frames per second. Reboot accepts no less. <laughs> Full screen three layer par parallax scrolling. Ooh. Yeah, because there's the front layer, there's one that's a little bit more faded, and then there's a very, very background that's like towers. Looks okay. like it's coming through very nicely. To open the portal on this map, you will need to obtain five fusion orbs. The guard up ahead is carrying a right. shield. When he's facing you, he's invulnerable to your energy bursts. Use a bomb to vanquish him, as his shield will not help against that. Fair enough. Excellent. How's the sound now? Oh no, there's an orb. Or there. shoot him when he faces away from you. Yes, that's the that's probably the best idea. Oh, that's one. I almost oh, missed there you that go. orb. I'm like, and then the top left it shows you how many orbs you need and you <gasps> Oh my goodness, I thought I was on the edge. On <laughs> Darn. Oh, well, it looks like you get infinite lives. No, I think you do need the three. Oh, that it. works too. Oh, there's oh. an orb down there. Oh my goodness. I wouldn't have well, passed that died, level anyway. Yeah. Maybe Goodness jump onto gracious. that so you don't oh. accidentally slip through. I already have three orbs. Alrighty. Uh, CRY lighting and transparency effects. Oh, we're going to have to double jump there. Ooh, Ooh just made it. Ooh, just. Uh, Storyline by Andrew Rosa. Lots and lots of animations. Yeah, there is a lot of stuff moving on the screen. This is at so once. beautiful. Missed the orbs below the floor. Uh, no, I. Didn't I get I think that's an old message. I was like, jeez. Did I? <laughs> shoot, 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 shoot. Oh, shoot. Now he's trying to hit three. You have to kill him. You um, try and shoot them when he's facing away No, you me. can't. I tried already. How oh, many shots did you shoot at him? There we go. No, it just bounced off him. Oh, off his back? Yeah. Oh, okay. So I'm assuming that doesn't work. You have to use the bomb, and I just timed that very poorly. Well, you didn't die. We're once again aiming for a full commercial quality as we did with Gravitic Mines, and we'll have downloadable demo with a few levels once moving forward enough. We have something to uh, we'll represent the panel. Hey! Psst, psst. <laughs> Don't jump around in there. We'll post updates here and when. Not setting a timetable, not setting any expectations. We're just making games and having fun. Join us for the ride. So on October 1st, uh, no, 4 out of 5, they posted, uh, or Cyrano posted, the Atari Age stand PRG will have a work in progress five level playable demo of Jumping in Shadows for people to check out. Oh, that's so nice. I'll let you. Yeah, no, it's okay. The cats are providing sound. Spikes don't land on them, as that will most surely hurt. <laughs> now they tell us. the guard by bouncing on his head three times. Oh, Mario uh, style. Oh, nice. One, two. Three. Oh, that's even easier. Look at the lighting effects. Oh, hidden orb. I don't need it, though. 
I already have five. You should get it. Bonus orbs. Get uh. it! There you go. You can practice your jumping. It kind of floats down a little bit. Ooh, another orb. Go for the bonus orbs. Ugh. Bonus orbs! Yay! Eight out of five! We will most likely also release this demo online as well during the show for anybody who can attend in person. Probably can't jump on that guy's head. No, that's fine. He looks like he has some rotors. And then October 14th, oh, went through nice. the portal. Jump into Shadows is loading the fun. Nice. Only light can drive out the darkness. Nice. Okay, so you can also place bombs on the moving platforms to deliver them oh. to the target. Just something to remember. Thank you, Laura. So on October 14th, the Jumping at Shadows PRG 10 2020 demo is now available to download at the reboot-games.com oh, site. You can't even touch it. Wow. Uh, and then from the website, it says time for the first public release for our new game, a five-level demo of the game. And no instructions were provided, just like modern games, they're oh. all in-game. There you go. Uh, Ivory Tower Collection says, It is demos for stuff like this. I got my Jag GD up here, G, but I'm kind of mad I have to keep the Jag CD detached in order to use it, though. Wow. Oh. You have a Jag CD? Wow. They're very expensive. Are they? Very expensive. Mm -hmm. But luckily, the Jag GD <gasps> can. Oh, no. back to the beginning. Yeah. I the do. Jag GD can play CD games, or I guess emulate uh, a CD image. So if you want to play older. CD games, um, then that's no problem. Ooh, how do you have to do a big double jump here, right? Yeah. Yeah, the um, <gasps> oh. strategy is to time. <gasps> oh, oh, damn it. That was terrible. I do, and it works. Oh, awesome. Yeah, um, lots more uh, Jag games coming out from uh, Reboot, so it's a good time to get a, a, a Jag game drive. Especially for games like this, you can play them. ITCS, uh, I haven't tried the actually tried the CD emulation function of it yet. I need to try and rip a few of my CD games to test it. Mm. Ooh, there's, a, there's a box up there. It's a red box. Yep. Oh, okay, that's where you have to go. Yep, I just need a two out of four. Four. So what level is this? Level three? Gotcha. Ah, uh, deliver the bomb. Oh, Jump right close. back on it. Just fall off it. No, no, I tried, but it's okay. Oh, didn't quite make it. I like the uh, not having lives, but I'm assuming <laughs> that might not be in the final game, but... Um, I don't know. I, I, I'm guessing that it's one of those games where you just keep going and going and there's no lives, but... Uh, Cyrano, is is it planned to have um, lives, or is it going to be play? Is it going to play like this, where it's more like it's a puzzle game where you have to go through each level and figure out everything? The plan is to have a countdown timer for groups of stages. Oh, okay. Oh god, too close. And the exploded at the bottom too. What? Yeah, it it. I forgot. What? Can I play? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, can I? I'll be right back. Hold on. Okay. No lives, but a clock. That makes sense. That makes sense. You have a limited amount of time to get to the end. Oops. <laughs> oh my god, dash. How did I do a dash? They haven't taught me about dashes yet. How did I do that dash? It's a C. That's the A button. That's what I was trying to press, and I accidentally pressed the C. No. Just a 
pan in the wall. Go over here, no. Okay. Yep, three levels of parallax. You can really see it here when I jump up. Hmm? Oh yeah, it's beautiful. Beautiful. Oh my god. Ever played Barely Hollow Knight? It. You've played Hollow Knight, have no, you? Not no, not Hollow Knight. No. I we that Shovel one. Knight. Shovel Knight, yeah. Which is, it, it's got all these platformers are, have some similarities um, in, in terms of like, I mean, there's a language to games, right? Yeah. Especially language to modern games. Oops. Oh, yeah. You have to be careful. You're not too close. I find hitting that three button awkward. <laughs> yeah. Because uh, you have to kind of reach down. I think the more you play, the more you get used to. Does this support a six button controller so you don't have to press the three? Or is there like tons of things that you eventually have to do? Which is what I'm guessing. Hmm. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, you can hit it three times. I thought you had to. Well, that's not one. the guy with the shield, though. Oh, I see. Okay. Ah, Ernie. Oh, you can't get up there now. <gasps> Time to learn about dashing. I already did. I accidentally dashed. <laughs> Push A to dash in the direction you're facing. Your aura will turn blue during the dash. After a dash, your aura will need a brief time to recharge. You can also dash while you're in the air. Mm -hmm. So where? No, How there's all the orbs that? down at the bottom. You need nine, so you probably have to get. Ooh. Mm. You have to dash back and forth, maybe. No. Oh yeah. Oh, you have to. But you have infinite lives. Can at you least dash in to the left? No. Can you? Oh. <laughs> can you dash? Oh, right? there's a, a platform there. Can you okay. dash up there? So no, why are you destroying that? Jump up there. No, I wanted to see. It's if a wall. It, it is a wall. Yeah. Oh, there might. I might be able to. Um, I'm gonna oh. die. There's actually. stuff on the left too. And go up on that. There's an orb on the left. Mmm. Is there? Can you jump? No. No, I can't get up that high. Uh, can you get up to the left? No. You have to dash and dash. The air. Fall to the left. And Fall dash. and dash in the air. Yeah, there you go. Good job. This is a checkpoint. You will be brought to the last checkpoint tagged if things go err, if you, when you err, perform suboptimally. Anyway, chain double jump and dash to overcome that deadly trap up ahead. I told you that you could move better than me. Oops. Oh, so that's the checkpoint there. So you jump and dash. Oops. <laughs> Wrong button. Oops. Yeah, you can just barely touch them. Hey, bad cat. No, you, you can't doing? even touch them from the side. Great cat. Or black cat. Oh, oh my God. close. You have to jump on an angle. Yeah. Think. Oops. Oh. Double jump into it. Oh, oh I hit my head. It's going to take a little bit of... Uh, Hi, baby cat. Oh, there we go. Come here. Hi. Hi. Are you cute? I'm a cute cat. Oh, you're cute. Oh, you want treats? Oh. Anyone out there with some bits left, eh? Oh, my God. There we go. Bits for the kittens. Bits. Bits for the kittens. Yeah. Any bits? Please, I want some more. We can shoot the wooden crates. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. good to know. Very okay, good. To know. <gasps> oh, Chalcedony Mao, thank you. Oh my gosh, the gray cat. You can hear him running down the burr, stairs. Burr, 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 burr. Yeah. Oh. We'll just pause the game because we want to see everything. <laughs> one In for big you, screen. One for you. Man, man. Who rang that? Who who rang that? Oh, that was the great cat. Cat stampede. Oh, it was a cat stampede. Uh, good thing you're playing. I can picture the frustration that Darcy would have with this game. Uh, he's one for you. And he, one for you. Uh, his forte is not platformers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my cats. I'm the platformer shooter. Tanya's the pit puzzle. I like the puzzle. I don't hate platformers. And Darcy's strategy. You like the shooters. Shooters, yeah. Shooters I'm not as good with the shooters. Okay, okay. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Hollow Knight is great. I'll have to check out Hollow Knight. Oh, yes. Okay. One for you. 
try Ooh, again. Chalcedony mouth. The cats thank you. Yes, they thank you very much. Good kid. <laughs> they're doing a lot better than when they're on the table during Atari HD. Oh, Atari HD, they were so confused. They're like, they're like uh, why push, is this push. on a table? Like, this is, it It all shifted around. Good kid. Atari touch me cat version. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Oh. Ding, ding, yeah. ding, ding. There you go. The next level up is they have to follow a sequence of lights. <laughs> One, and then two, <laughs> Sorry. And then three. Okay, 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 I get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Treats. Got me. so many points to cash in. Awesome. <laughs> You'll be the cat feeder from for the next little yeah, bit. Yeah, yeah. So I think some people have really been feeding the cats. A lot, and they've run out of... Uh, Haven't seen the young guy in your show in a while. Forget the name. Erlen. Yes. Yeah, he's yeah. busy with work, but I hope to get him on in the future, especially for the four-player day. Oh, yeah. Because he does want to come back on. Yeah. You just, okay. you just have to find the right day. Thank you. They were very efficient with those bells. <laughs> ding, ding. I had oh, a handful ding, ding. of them, and, and right in. Thank you, Chalcedony Mill. The cats thank you very yes, much. Yes, they do. Shut up and feed me. Yes. And now they leave. Ah, this is what cats. happens. At least there's a, a checkpoint, which is <gasps> not pretty far back yes. now. You have enough orbs to pass the level. Oh. Ooh, that was... So... Well, nice. It takes quite a few shots, but it's probably, Three. E Three. probably easier than... Oh, probably easier than um, planting a bomb. It is. Some of them. I... Dash. No! <gasps> oh, oh, no! So hard! Can you jump if after you <laughs> fall? They are really on the bell tonight. <laughs> on the ball, on the. Uh, oh. That's hard. Is that like a fan above you, too? I don't know. Yeah. Oh, you have to make sure you don't clip it. Those, you have to really make sure you. Wow, that's hard. <laughs> Yeah, you kind of have to let yourself start to come down before you... Yeah. I, I think that's the key. Not that that's easy to do, but... No. Uh, <gasps> Damn it. Hold right plus dash. Ah, that's what I was doing. Yeah, okay. I was just accidentally doing that each time. Yeah, like the flappy bird mechanic there to get through that. Haha, -ha, says Metal Lunar. <laughs> hey, Metal Lunar, how's it going? <laughs> Oh no! Oh no! I used it too early! Oh, kitten! You had so many! You don't need more. Fluffy, look at that fluffy tail. Says, yes, I do. I need You're, more. You're like, what are you doing? Oh, <laughs> He's being a bad cat. Oh, what's up, baby? You want to play with the, the oh. dinosaur? There you go. I want to see this dash. Okay, go straight across. Up, up, and straight across. There you oh, go. Oh, it actually goes up too. Yeah. Okay. You are letting go of movement when dashing. You have to keep pushing in the direction. Is that what you're saying? Um, a little yeah. bit. There's I a more to the dashing to than. Too. Um, nice. Because you can do the dashing goes. Dashing can go up. Mm. And the dashing can go to the side too. What is it, baby? Huh? And the dashing goes a little bit further if you hold to the side. Okay. There Ooh, we go. Oh, there you go, finally. Oh, that was Good right. Good job. Yeah. yeah, that was the end there. The darkness allows the All light right, to Laura. Shine. What does Laura have to say? Careful, the guard up ahead is wearing a heavy mech suit. He seems to be invincible and bullies people by firing deadly rockets at ah, them. Ah, projectiles. Mm. His weak spot is his head. Bounce on that four times to make him dizzy and then place a bomb at his feet to blow him up. Oh, wow, wow, that's complicated. It's like boss time. Or you could just run away. Fair enough. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, is there anything so we to can the go... right? Oh, no, that's the edge. Nope, nothing to the right? No. Yeah, okay. so it's like this look. Fair enough. This doesn't look like you can walk through it, but you can. So. Yeah. Well, actually, you glow a bit. It's Kev73, super Meat Boy vibe from this level. A little bit, because yes. you're bouncing around. Oh. And you get infinite tries. So four bounces, and then a oh, bomb. <gasps> oh, you have did to hit I him miss right. Yeah, you did. Yeah. Just that barely. is pretty tight. <gasps> Can you touch hit him? him. Oh, oh, good okay. to know. That's okay. That's why you get lots. Oh, you have to be very precise with this guy. Yeah. Got 
Nice, get the orbs. Don't forget the orbs. Well, maybe you have to bomb that one. Yeah, that might be a bit more. Yeah, Just the, the wooden crate. one you can shoot, but Ooh, the red one. <gasps> what's How going on? How do you get in there? Hmm. Can you bomb it? Or maybe you come back around from the other side? Did I miss? I don't know, something? maybe. Maybe there was something. Damn it. No. Oh, uh -huh. got it. You dashed up. Nope. Can't go down. Interesting. Can you bomb something? Is there a secret thing that I can bomb? Nope. Maybe that won't? No. Okay. Maybe he bombs it. Oh, Maybe no. Maybe you have to let him bomb it. Yeah. You can die. I could. I probably will anyway, so. Just die. Die. Try it again. See if he can bomb it. Well. Oh well. There's the portal. You can die, die and try it again. No, couldn't play it properly. Uh, you want me to do it? Yeah. I do. I want you to try that and see if he bombs it. Maybe it's there to tease you. That is certainly possible. Okay. Come on, shoot, shoot me. me. No. Nope. What? No, nope. it goes through. Damn it. So he can shoot through it, but I... Come on. Come on. And you can't shoot it. Come on. Hmm. Hmm. Tricky. Maybe it collapses on the left. Maybe. Hmm. I can't... No, I can't get hmm. to it. It's just to tease me. It is. <laughs> oh, you do Sorry. have to be really precise. Yeah. What are you doing? What are you doing down there? Oh, you're so cute. Come here. Come sit on your pillow. There you go. Is that his pillow? He's, he's, look, he's on his pillow. Look at this little guy. <laughs> oh, princess You are a cat. princess. A prince. A princely cat. Princely yes, cat. you are. Yeah. Be careful. Yeah. I like the dashing. It's like mm -hmm. magic. This is the end of the Jumping uh, at Shadows demo. We hope that the final game will be available mid-2023 via Atari Age. Oh. Thank you for your support. It means a great deal to us and is very motivational. It is. See you all soon. Reboot will return. Amazing. It really is. I'm going to go. Beautiful, amazing game. If you touch that, you go through it, right? Very cool style. So I'm not going to touch so it. So see if you can get above it. Uh -huh. There. Can you go over to the left? Nope. No, nope. how am I gonna But do that's this? that's empty there. Uh no. I can't. No, you can't? I have oh to you can shoot can't. one of them. No, maybe it's just a tease. Oh, no. Oh, come on. Get stop it. Okay, I can think I can shoot one from here. Yep. Four. You can't get Oh, this. I can't get that one. No. Oh I can bomb it. Oh, you can go beneath that and be on it. Mm. Hmm. Interesting. Thank you. Trying to make it modern and unique. Oh, it looks very fantastic. modern. It looks like a modern retro game. game. Yeah, it does. And it plays like one, But too. it's actually on a retro console. Yeah, it's beautiful. And it plays with modern sensibilities. Yes. And, and looks modern as well. So excellent, oh, it's excellent fantastic. job. Um, and the parallax scrolling and the animation and the art style is beautiful. And it's, it's it uses the Jaguar to great effect. It's yeah. it's excellent. It is great. Great demo. job, Cyrano. Excellent, excellent job. I can't wait to play the full version. <laughs> um, looks really great, and uh, I'm guessing it's going to be quite a big adventure. Yeah. Do you have any um, ideas of how big or how sprawling you're going to make it, or is it just like we'll just keep adding till we stop? <laughs> yeah. I guess we're getting there. Awesome. Looking yeah, it does great. look great so it far. It looks fantastic. Off we go to the end. Jumping at Shadows Long and Fun. Nice. Then it repeats. Awesome. Nice. So you can loop and play it again and discover new things. I am very excited about this game. Yes. It's the yeah. exact type of games I love to play. Probably Platform 35 puzzles. levels, 5 zones. That sounds wow. fantastic. That's that great. sounds very uh, ambitious, and too. I'm guessing so they would get luck. bigger and bigger and yeah. there'd be more and more checkpoints. Oh, yeah. it's beautiful. It's a beautiful yeah. game. Um, so beautiful game. 
we are going to um, play Stormbringer now as much as we can. I'm I know excited. we're not going to finish it, but we're going to oh, try and jot down some things that we discover. So we, so we, it is does have saving. On I it, started so. figuring stuff out when we were Did when you I was find playing some it. Stuff? Yeah, no, I I think I think I I can figure it out. That'll keep James and Tanya busy. Yes, it will. Yes. So we looked. It's a beautiful game. Through the manual a little bit. Now I can read the manual mm. um, this time around. But we did show off the box last time. So mm. if you want to look at the box, go to Atari Age Day. It uh, is gorgeous. It really is. Uh, the artwork on this is beautiful. I'll go through the um, credits of who did what in a second mm. after we start this going. And I don't know if I should write down some stuff as we go through it, or I don't think you need to. It seems it does. It seems uh, uh, it seems a very Oops, linear think. game. You go to the left, and then you can't go any further, and then you have to go to the right, and then the Stormbringer comes, and you have to be very careful because it'll immediately kill you. So, I right. think you have to do things quickly. You have to kind of figure it out and then die and then figure it out and die. Like, oh, do you know no. what I mean? And start over. What? Oh no! What's wrong? Oh, I reset the chat because I put on the. Screen. Oh, you reset it. Oh, that's okay. Un unfortunately. Keep notes. Draw maps. <laughs> that's what I like to do. Yeah, it, there's not much in the way of maps. I mean, it's pretty Stop left, it. right, but I think Little you Jaguar. do just like notes and maps. I think uh, you do end up in a different level and you uh, transport through, and through stuff. a transporter, but but I think it's like uh, fairly left, right. Yeah. Stormbringer, a true graphic adventure by David Jones. Jaguar conversion by Lauren nice. Stapley. Oh, I was going to wait, 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 wait. What? Um, before we do that, I'm just going to mute it. Don't do anything. Oh, please. come on. I want to start. No, I want to show off the ZX Spectrum so we know where it came from. Okay. Because it looks... Just to show how much the it has progressed. Because uh, it looks oh. pretty different. It oh, does, actually. Uh -oh. There were a couple of different versions, though. Yeah, I just want to show off the really early uh, version of it. Come here, Sprite. And I actually played the first um, part of this game. Uh, this is the fourth part to a series of games with the same character in them. Um, and the first one is called Finders Keepers. Mm. Um, and let's go to YouTube. So this is the, the game I played on the um, C64. Oh, you played this one. This was yeah. number one? Yeah, this the is the first, first one. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Seizure inducing. This is uh, uh, loading from tape, obviously. That's the music that plays forever. <laughs> forever, continuously. Just continuously. But it's very good, very good uh, music. So you play that little, uh, little night guy. Nice. And uh, there's teleporters, and all the objects are represented by little glowing triangles. Wow. And it's more action-y, I would guess, I would say, because you have, you to, have to avoid things. things. Or avoid things you yeah. have to avoid things that are going all over the screen and spiders that are coming down. And um, But like in the game that we're going to play, you pick up objects and they interact with other objects. And you have a strength meter and it goes down as you run into mm. things. So let's just jump ahead a little bit here. At least I'm still on the same screen. <laughs> He's gonna die. <laughs> He's right over the snail. So that's basically what you do. Uh, it drove me crazy. Uh, it was a very difficult game because you pick up these objects that are like what is that and what's that for and you have to combine objects mm. and like it gives you like cat Zero food and information cat about... food and glue and oh, it's that's like funny. okay what do i use that for and this for this person that's playing is not very good because <laughs> they're just dying <laughs> they're not picking up anything i don't think they oh there we go they're on one of the wait a second they haven't made it past the second screen by the looks of things they did touch one 
Nope, they didn't pick it up. This is a terrible playthrough. Okay, so um, let's take a look at the ZX Spectrum version of the game we're going to play, Stormbringer. Mm -hmm. And then we can kind of compare the, yeah. the looks of it. bouncing around. I don't know if this is the demo. Bounce, 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 bounce. Oh, no. This is a playthrough, so they're going to do it like super quick. And uh, Cyrano said this version is completely different, like in terms of objects and order and things you oh, do. Oh, really? Because he had to get the um, game testers to play it fully. Mm. And there is no playthrough cheat that he could find. So... Um, he it, just the, the playtester had to do it from scratch. From dip, they yeah. had to okay. figure the game out themselves. Okay. But uh, you can see how the ZX Spectrum uh, draws things and colors things. Yeah. It's like, well, this this block is white, or it's yellow, yeah. or it's green, right? So yeah, wishing well. Pick up an object. We saw that. All that. And you're yeah, playing the screens it. are kind so of the same. So it's the same. It's pretty much the graphics. Yeah. Is the, is the big difference. The music's pretty good, actually, in this. It is. Yeah. It is. Yeah. Impressively good. Okay, so let's get Distinctively to. Distinctively spectrum y. Very yes. spectrum y. Oh, uh, yep. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, so let's go back to our game. I'll turn the music again for it. Music's fantastic. Yeah. All right, now we're starting. So there's like neutral people that you can talk to. Mm -hmm. And how do you talk to them? You examine them? I can examine them. Okay. Strength, happiness, magic, and food. So you can pick up or take an object. And so you pick got up. a hint book. And what was that? Oh, so quick. So let's take a look at those things. So you got a burger and a... Yeah, so this... Advert. Okay. I can wear it, apparently. <laughs> oh, no. I can read it or blow it. Okay. Uh, so probably okay. read it. Because it's ah! advert. Throw, oh. no. Is there a back button? No, there isn't. No? You're all alone. So I guess you just have to make sure you're on the right yeah, thing you want. Yeah, it's really sensitive. Oh, it's the ad for the game itself. Yeah. Oh, that, 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 that was too quick. No, I I'm dropping it. it. I don't need it in my, in my no, inventory. You don't. Okay, well, we didn't get to read it. Um, so Stormbringer is by Lawrence Stavely, uh, Cyrano J, The Jaguar Port, the original program of David Jones, uh, Benedict Sheffer, uh, Cabbage, packaging artwork. Um, Stormbringer is a computer game. This is from Wikipedia. Stormbringer is a computer game written by David Jones and released in 1987 by Mastertronic on the Mastertronic Added Dimension label. It was originally released on ZX Spectrum, Commodore 64, Amstrad, CPC, and MSX. A version for the Atari ST was published in 1988, which this is a conversion of the Atari ST. Is that the flower? That's just a background object. Can't do it. Things might interact with it. You may not be able to pick it up. Bottle of liquid, so you can read it. <laughs> I'm guessing read is read the drink label. it. Oh, read the label. Looks like poison. Yield grog brewed by the old way by P. Artist and Son. Oh, that's the menu. So you've saved it to the cartridge. This has got to save. Lots to save. Because there's so many objects. Saving in the game. it to oh tape, my God. obviously. I'm not touching that guy. Yeah, don't touch him. He looks drooly. <laughs> <laughs> Trivia Mastertronic botched the mastering of this game, and every copy appears to have some corrupted graphics. Oh boy. 
I repaired them with bitmaps from other versions. Wow. So, you, uh, like the mastering of uh, the Atari ST version. Wow, that's crazy. Mm. And they never uh, issued a uh, updated version of the game. And how far into the game were the corrupted graphics? Was it like right at the beginning and it was obvious? Um, and they just went, eh, we're done with it. We, we've sold it. We've made our money. Um, so the plot... Magic Knight returns home, having obtained a second-hand time machine from the Time Guardians at the end of t night time. However, there's been an accident whilst traveling back, and there are now two Magic Knights, the other being Off-White Knight. Uh, the dreaded Stormbringer, so-called because his storm cloud, which he plans to use to destroy Magic Knight, used to destroy Magic Knight. Magic Knight cannot kill the Off-White Knight without destroying himself in the process. His only option is to find Off-White Knight and merge with him. The character you can't get past him, so it was really early on. Oh wow, that's that's a big bug and pretty lazy of them to uh, to not correct that. Like even like I guess they pressed like Atari ST. Was it on a a, a disc then? I guess you don't want to stand under that too long. You died last time, right? Yeah. Load game also crashed it. Wow, that's horrifically bad that's unbelievable gameplay takes the form of a graphic adventure because literally this could be made as a text adventure <gasps> you got me oh my goodness uh oh man nah. run away run so i guess you can't just you have to keep moving don't stand under it right privet the hedge pig oh Na, 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 na. Your hands are full. Your hands are full. Full of things. You've got a birdie. Didn't the birdie lay an egg? At some, like last time you played it, you got the bird to lay an egg? The hardware scroll. This hardware scroll is part of the Ama Amama. Two M's. Maybe that's, is that the in the original? Amazing <laughs> graphics chip designed to give your ST, yeah, most wonderful, the most yeah. wonderful graphics ever. At the bottom, er, sorry, black. we forgot to fit it. <laughs> in black on a black background, it reads, "Er, sorry, we forgot to." What? Funny. So it says the most amazing graphics, and yet they had shipped it with shipped it with corrupted graphics. That's irony. My hands aren't full, are they? Oh yeah, that's right. Impressively buggy. Banana. You can read the banana. An arrow points to one end and a label reads hold here and pull. Oh, so you can like open the banana? No, it's just no? being silly. It's being silly. I think you smelled it last time, right? <laughs> no noticeable smell on whatever you just smelled. A fruity whiff assails your nostrils. Oh, you're so quick. Um, the need for a player to monitor Magic Knight's strength and avoid enemy means that means the Stormbringer's gameplay is closer to the arcade adventure feel of Spellbound rather than the much more pure graphical adventure feel of Nighttime. So in this game, you can die because you can run out of energy. Oh my god. How did I run out of energy? Oh. Did that thing hurt you? No. The orb? I don't know. Well, you saved before you got hit by the cloud, right? I'm not going to start at the beginning. Or does it start you at your last save point? Banana foam. I know what's where. <laughs> Have you interacted with that well? Can you like 
get water from it? Or is it just purely background? Command a character. <laughs> oh, you can tell them, like, get out of the way. Or ask them for help. There's a lot you can do. As with the previous two Magic Knight games, there are characters with whom Magic Knight can interact and have help him. Magic Knight's spellcasting abilities are also important for solving the game's puzzles, including the Merge spell to be used when he finds the Off-White Knight. Oh, can't get the newspaper from him. Oh, is that the Sun newspaper? British newspaper. So, with that disguise, we learn you can change into different characters mm -hmm. and maybe influence characters to be able to give something to you that they wouldn't normally give to you because they're more inclined to give it to somebody, somebody else. So, about the Magic Knight character. It's a computer character created by freelance programmer David Jones for the 1985 Finders Keepers on the Mastertronic bu budget label. Finders Keepers is... Uh, well, that talks about Finders Keepers. So the uh, four games are Finders Keepers, Spellbound, Nighttime, and Stormbringer. Let's read in the manual that comes with it. Oh, the Hedgehog. He's not asleep. He's awake. Doesn't look awake. Close his eyes. I'm gonna give him a banana. Did it, what did it say? Did it work? Hmm. Oh, he has the banana now? I took it back. <laughs> At least you can get things back. Oh, the write-up is the same... well, similar. The story so far, Magic Knight has rescued his friend and tutor, Gimbal the Wizard, from a self-inflicted whiteout spell and then finds himself catapulted into the 25th century aboard the starship USS Pisces. Having acquired the second-hand time machine from the Time Guardians, Magic Knight finally reaches his own time and planet with a slight problem. Whilst traveling back, a serious malfunction occurred with the second-hand time machine. Now, horror of horrors, there are two Magic Knights. The other Magic Knight is a real nasty piece of work. He calls himself the Off-White Knight, but locally is known as Stormbringer because of his powerful and dangerous storm cloud, which he is planning to use to destroy Magic Knight. So why did you die last time? I don't know. Um... should examine yourself and see how much health you have. I did last time and I was at 15%. 50. 50, okay. Lots of time magic. Time left eight hours, I don't know. Hmm. Cyrano, the guard won't let you pass in less, insert hint. Is that the guard? I'm guessing. Yeah. <gasps> he zaps you immediately. Oh my god, you have to run away fast. We have to figure now? something out. Yeah. What's your health at now? My health? It's the same. It's 50%. It doesn't change. Oh, I thought he zapped you. Yeah, but I don't think it does. And zapping kills you. Yeah, 24 now. My food level or, or my strength? Strength. How do I get my strength up? Eat. Have you tried to eat something? Or can you How, eat something? You can't. Uh, no, you can't eat something. You can smell it, take it, give it. Hint, find a newspaper. Oh, you have to give the guard a newspaper so he's distracted. Where did you see a news the Sun newspaper? But somebody wouldn't give you the Sun newspaper. Takes an egg. Ah, he wanted an egg. That's very odd. Alright, whatever. So, you have to take the newspaper to the guard. Thank you for the hint to get us started, Cyrano. That, that cloud is it's gonna come and get me. I don't know how to get past it. And oh, just keep you walking. Just keep running. Did you pause last time it zapped you at all? Well, no, yeah, but I when, when that, I hit that thing and it killed me, 
I don't know what happened there. I must have just... Yeah, I don't know what happened there. That was very strange. No? Hmm? Is that the guard that he's talking about? Oh, command a character... Oh, go to sleep. <laughs> oh, to go away, maybe? Oh, now nah, that won't work. Try reading it. Oh, okay. So you have to read the newspaper to him? Maybe that falls, makes him fall asleep? Oh, he wants to keep it now. I can't get it back from him. Oh, no. Maybe he'll trade it for a banana? Oh, you can pick up it up. What is that? Crystal ball. Wait, you can read it. Hmm. Oh. The ma magic missile induces sleep in anyone it is thrown at. Hmm. Oh, uh oh. Here comes the cloud. The chicken eggs are on a timer from the chicken. Hmm. Spell power. I think as long as you're moving, he doesn't... That makes sense. If you're standing one spot, he just kills you. Does energy just constantly I, I go down, maybe? I don't know how you get more energy. Hmm. Hmm. You want to play? Done. <laughs> no, no, I, I, I don't mind. I just... Oops. Energy goes down. You can examine self to check levels. So it just constantly goes, goes down? You, there must be ways of getting it back up, though. Yeah. Oops. Examine self. yourself. 96, so we already went from 100 to down 4? But it says 9 hours wow. left, I don't understand. How do we get out of this menu? Oh, you can't, you have to do something. You have to do anything. Smell it. <laughs> okay, so let's get the newspaper. Is that from him? Take. He want, he'll, he'll, he'll he exchange it for an egg, so you... Oh, okay. Yeah. Go get the get chicken. That chicken. Pick him up. Just yeah, pick up, and then eventually he'll create a neck. And you can pick that up too, but I'm not sure what value that has. Hardware scroll. I mean, maybe it has. It serves a purpose. Read it. That's. It says you can read it. The yeah. game itself. But it's I mean, I don't wall. know if it has a purpose. You can drop it and yeah, pick it up taking later. Up inventory can at you the go moment. into that? Uh, drop, take, examine? No. It, unless it's an object, which it's not. Come back here. Give me that paper. You want an egg? No, oh, he doesn't. You don't have an eggie. No, and then you have to give him something. You have to take it back from him. Because you can't get out of a... Yeah. Uh, maybe you can eat the burger? Yeah, maybe. Read, wear, blow, nothing. I think you can just give it to someone. You can smell it, maybe, I don't know. <laughs> So the clues you need to decipher. Yum yum, almost, almost good enough to eat. You have to get the chicken back from him. Um, you don't have the chicken. He won't lay an egg until you take him back, so. Okay. Yeah. Will he give it back to me? Yep. Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah, and eventually I just have he'll to lay an egg. Wait. Yeah. Let's uh, see how much down. 74 already? I know, I don't know how. 
What the hell? Energy goes down, you can, yeah. Nine hours until Stormbringer does evil things. Okay, well, we're definitely not gonna last nine hours. Oh, you can drink that, though. Maybe that's how you get your energy back, your strength back up. Mm. Just drops the SBCS. I don't think there's any value in that at all. There you go. I think you can drink it when your energy level gets down. You can read it, too. Because it's the grog, right? Oh, you've got an egg now. Oh, good. I'm pretty sure that does, so maybe hold on to that until... <gasps> Why would you do that? You have to wait until you're low. Oh, oops. You're almost high. Oops. He only has 4%. I could get it. Did it go to 100? Didn't even go to 100. Well, it might have. Now we're down 2. Yeah. We'll know that for next time. And then you take his... Nope. Oh, no. You have to get the egg back from... Take the egg back. Oh, no. You need a second egg. Oh, he wants two eggs. No, you need to take it Take it from him, and then he'll take the egg from you. Go, go, go examine. Examine. Yeah. Object? Yeah. So you have an egg. Okay. So go to him and ask for... No, don't... Oh, just, I have to get out of it. Yeah, but go to him and ask for... Um, that. Yeah, he'll take the egg from oh, you. Oh, four in this ask. paper. Yeah. You can't just give him No, egg. no, and I think that's the problem, but that's okay. Uh, uh, run away. Run away. Running. Run from the evil, evil cloud. The clues play into it somehow because someone has to decipher them but mm. oh maybe you give it to him i don't know the, the clues? clues i don't know okay well you're not gonna do that so that's okay <laughs> what the clues i thought we we're gonna go read the newspaper to the guard and use the hint <sighs> that, uh, that cyrano says no stop you'll die I can't. Doesn't Drop. even say I'm full. Yeah, you're full. Drop him. Yeah. Take the clues quickly. You're all alone. So there's no. Maybe I'm not right on top of it. Weird. Weird. <gasps> I was gotcha. walking. I'm walking here. Talk to him. Take an object. Take an object from him. Yeah. He gives you the command spell. So now you have a command spell. Okay. Oh. Command a character. That's how you talk with him? No. Go to sleep, wake up, go away. So you can make the guard go to sleep. Oh, maybe, maybe yeah. Maybe that's all you need to do. Hmm. I like how the title of the game is like perpetually there with the name, the name of the person who made it. <laughs> it's like, you're going to know. There's a crystal ball. And a character to fall asleep. He's already asleep. Okay. Then, or yeah. maybe that just means he, he is asleep. Ugh. <laughs> Situation's vacant. Wizard wanted to replace fortune teller who was called away at short notice. Oh, so get the, the crystal ball. Maybe you need that. Oh, that's an empty bottle. Oh. <laughs> and a broken bottle now. Can you leave? Can you, can you go to the right? Go away. Oh, he goes away. <gasps> okay. Can't go in there. Nope, oh, you're stuck. Oh, wizard wanted. If only you had a disguise kit. Thank you, Serena. <laughs> uh, Where? Where's Oh. Okay. But okay. Oh, that's how you do it. Nice. 
So that's a little switch. Well, there's a key there. Should I get the key first? Yeah. Never be able to go back. <laughs> I'm full. Oh, it picked up something that was on the ground that was underneath the key. What is that? Teleport, Teleport pad. pad. Oh, can okay. Read it too. I don't know if it's going to say anything, say very much. Ah. <gasps> you have to put it down then. <laughs> drop it and then use it. Can you pick up the key? I'm full, so I'll drop the teleport pad. And then pick up the key. If I can. Yep. Oh, pushed me. Okay. Can you jump up? Oops. Can you jump? No, to the right. No, no? it's too tall. <gasps> oh, he's... That's why there's a teleport pad. Teleport. It says teleport right there. Oh. So that this changes depending. Where am I? Oh, what? I didn't teleport anywhere. Teleported to the same place. Am I stuck? <laughs> oh my wow. god. It is demanding. Hmm. Interesting. You can get the you can get it from him right away. Talk to him. Take an object. There you go. So let's use my uh, disguise to try. Thank and get you, lost. Ivory Tower Collections, for joining us. Thank you. Have a good night. There you go. Pick that up. Definitely want that when your health gets low. Yep. So I'm going to try a different disguise to try and get past this. Oh no, he, you touch him, you, you die. 91%, oh my god. You have to wear it. Wear it. God, it's going to take a bit to uh, figure this out. So what should I be to get past this guy? Ghoul? Probably a ghoul would be the best. I'm a ghoul, let me pa Oh. <laughs> it's Miss good to try that right away because yeah. rather than do a bunch of stuff. This music is so 90s. So relaxing. I know. Well, I, I have found. Well, it might be the sounds that are used in the Jaguar, like the set mm. of sounds. Or it could be like uh, a thing that's on purpose that is like, oh, this is a 90s system, mm. so let's make sure it sounds 90s. So let's cast a spell. Spell the Wounder? Traveled person? Magic Fulcrum? Maybe Wounder. Pseudicus. Feel the mutual magic drain away, but nothing else seems to happen. Okay, well, that didn't wound him. And yourself. So my magic should have gone down. Yeah. Quite a bit. Strength is still high. Wow, strength's really high still. Yeah. Let's try another spell. So we can do one more. <laughs> Quiticus Gamus. Uh, dimension merge? No. Because that's what you have to do with the white. Mm. With the off white version of yourself. Melt Grand? Let's try that. Maybe you need more so I'm out of mm. not enough. I don't think I have anything that would uh wonder if he's hungry. <laughs> oh maybe. Yeah, you could give him Let's get that burger. Oh, let's pick that up. Yeah. Or the banana. Or the banana? Maybe the banana. We'll try both of them. Let's get the burger. And then let's drop. That. Mm -hmm. What is that other thing? Oh, it's for saving your game. Oh, okay. I mean, you can drop it. Yeah. I just want to try and feed that guy. Hello. We're on a mission for a banana. Don't zap me. Here's the chicken. Not right now. Banana. Try and feed that hungry beast. 
We won't be able to give it to him. You'll have to drop it? I don't know. Can't, like you have to be on top of the other character to give it to them, maybe? Or no, can you he, be near he it? cannot get close to him. He kills you immediately. Yeah, but I'm wondering if you can just be near. And yeah, it's that's good, what I mean. And it's good enough. Hmm. Hello, flower. Um, Give an object? Oh, you can. There you go. But where's my burger? Did I not pick up the burger? No. Want a banana? Oh, wow. nope. Not a lot of options there. Did not there. like that. Let's get the burger and try that next. Maybe you can command him. Where's the burger? Maybe you can command oh, him to maybe. fall asleep. You get that from that other let's, guy. Let's get the wand as well. The wand is, you just ask for it, so. Yeah. This guy, right? Mm-hmm. No, take. You just take an object from. Rude. Just take it. Just take it. Oh, there's just a burger. take it. Pick up the burger. Maybe he wants a burger. So we'll try the wand and try to It'll get him to go to sleep. probably just lash out at you, but still. Get the grog. Okay, mister. Um, you want a burger? No. Let's try the wand. I doubt it's that easy. No, I do too. Oh. He doesn't Unfortunately, really you fall straight down when you jump. It doesn't continue to jump. Okay, let's cast a spell. We already tried some of these, not all of them. Pass plant? We tried the spell of wounder and that just Did zapped every. But I thought you were going to give him the. Um, or try to command. Oh, okay. Well, let's try and pass plant. You cannot cast that spell yet. Okay. Uh, command him. Go to sleep. <laughs> He's not tired. Mm, oh my nope, goodness. You can't even do with anything him with him. Yep. Something very specific you probably have to do. It's one of those old school games. You have to do things in a very specific order, probably you to can do it die. on time. Yeah. By doing specific things. Uh, okay. He's full of magic. He is asleep. Funny. That's maybe why you can take sleeping Maybe. Up. Yeah. So have you done things with this? The you and you need someone to interpret it for you. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't... So oh. you can probably command a character to read it. I don't know. Ancient dialect of... Digitus Ramicus Computerus. <laughs> Translate. Hmm. Maybe I can tell this guy to wake up. Oh, there we go. Oh, come back here. Um, would I give it to him then? And then... Give them? Yeah, give you can things. take stuff from them. Yeah. Hmm. Hi. Oh, he 
just after me. You are so cute. Oh no. I might have to take a... You have to give him a egg. Yeah. He's right by the bird. Like he's on top of the yeah. bird. It's easy. You just pick up an object. There you go. How is my health? Do I have to drink the thing yet? Oof. Almost. Can't examine the well, can you? No. Hi. Hi. Per cat. Hi, you're so cute. Are you enjoying this after dark? You like Stormbringer? <laughs> mm -hmm. Do you want to eat the... Do you want to eat the... Hedgehog? Burger? Oh, it's not asleep. You can command him... To go away? Help, help. Mm. Privet cannot help. Can you give him something? I don't know. So Clues? once you're in here, you can't yeah. not give it. Yeah, I know. It's kind of annoying. There's no other option. I guess he... Then he took it. Hmm. Maybe he likes bananas. Do you like bananas? <laughs> he doesn't have anything. You can't take anything from him, right? No. You know, well, he has banana. Yeah. Oh, right. my hands are full. I must have a bird. Oops. Oh, yeah. You can go back and get the. Uh... Run, 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 run. Oh, I better uh, check out my health. 22. I think I should drink it. How do you drink it? Examine? Oh, I don't, don't have, have it. it. Oh, thought I had it. Go take it. Where is it? It's not that far. I'm much faster than you. Let's race. I'm winning. I think if you read stuff, that's when you. There it yeah. is. Just in time. Oh, oh no. Drop the chicken. Read it. Uh, that did it. Nope. No, you have to uh, have a drink. Have a drink. Yeah, it does. Oh, it added it. So that should go. get me up to 100. Yeah. Yeah, good. More or less. Hi. Now, who's the person who has the... Get the burger. You get a burger? Oh, you have to drop the, the bottle. Because it's empty anyway. You can drop the SBCS, too. Unless there's a reason to have it, but I don't think so. No, and him. he's the guy. So I have to take, take. it. There you go. That's how you trade things. Now that teleport, I was just trapped. You were trapped. So I don't know how you get out of that. Do you so think that you... tree is menacing that guy? Something to do with that tree? Yeah. So what was this? I have to you, read You have it. to turn into a, a wizard. I think if you just turn into a wizard. Um, uh, wear something. Wear something, that's it. Oh, you don't have it. Oh. I'll wear the newspaper. Stop being silly. Oh, it's not always a wizard, so you have to read the sun. Read. Read. Right. Same thing. Spooks and specters for night work. Nothing to do with a wizard. It was a completely different thing. You need to turn yourself into something completely different, but you don't have it. You have to go get it. Mm. So you need it. to be, yeah. You're like, same thing. I'm like, no. It said something completely different. You gotta do the thing it says. Cyrano's giving us hints. Mm. <laughs> so I guess it changes every single time. It's not always oh, the same disguise. 
What just happened to the go. disguise? I guess it was pretty far back. I or might have run dropped it somewhere. <laughs> ran yeah. out of strength. Hi, bird. Where oh my is God. it? Did I give it to somebody? It was on the first screen. Yeah, it's like right away. Did somebody pick it up? Hey, do you have it? I don't remember you giving it to someone. You must have an egg. Nope. It's gone. No, keep going. Gone forever. That's weird. Pick that up. Oh, my hands are full. It's not there. No. Yeah, I don't know where it went. Oh, you're wearing it. You're oh, wearing it. Oh, well then, how come I can't... Unwear. You have to unwear it. Oh. You have to drop something first. Well, I can un... Oh. You have to drop something first. So right. drop the bottle. Oh. I'll drop the bottle, too. No. No! That's fine, too. <laughs> Smash. And then unwear. Or, yeah, I have to unwear it. I have to wear it. Oh, old games. <laughs> cool. Should I pick up any of those? No. I think you should pick up the burger, but... Random thing! There. Yeah, that's fine. Great animation on that. Yeah. So what did we do We do last time? So pick up the crystal ball. I would drop whatever you picked up that you don't want. Probably the sun. You probably don't need that anymore. Right, because that's just for a clue. Yeah, and then pick up. Yeah. And then you should be able to walk through. There you go. Nope. Nope? No. Said ghouls. Do you need to have the sun? You have to be something to tell him to go away. I don't know. No. Oh no, I can't. Get no, in you there. need the sun in your possession, I guess. No, you can. You have enough space for it. Yeah. Mm. So. Pull lever. A heavy block rises from the ground, filling the large hole in the floor. Yay. Of course, that gets rid of the key. But lets us pass, at least. Yeah, there yeah. you go. Maybe you need another teleporter yeah, later somewhere. on and then bring it there. I drop. The sun. Drop the sun. I don't think you need that. Oh, why am I dropping things on top of other things? Oh, no. That makes things difficult. Let's uh, let's pick it up and then look at it. Yeah. See what it is. Silver bell. I can't do anything with it. Read no. where blow. Well, you have it. No demony thing. Oh, we send the bell? Oh, yeah, I guess you can't really do anything with that. Hmm. Do more demons? Well, you are safe in here from the cloud. Yeah, it seems like it. Big long hallway. Another oh. lever. Well, we have to pull it. The lever springs back to its original position. Funny, nothing seems to have happened. Not in this room. Uh, were there four of right? those things can before? Go to the right? Uh, yeah. Oh my nope. goodness. Oh. oh. Potion? Yes. Um, uh, burger for now. Let's see what Can my you health pick up is. The other thing? Before we do anything. Oof, it's getting down. I have to drop something else. Have a drink? No? Uh, yeah. It could kill you, but. Uh, it's yellow. No. You don't have to drop anything if you drink it. Oh, yeah, okay. Yep, back to full. I still have to drop the empty flask. Smash. What is that? 
It is. Looks like a shield. Glow, Glow shield. shield. Wear it. Ooh, maybe I can be protected now from something. Wear something? Yeah. Don't oh, you still my... got your disguise on. Interesting. Hmm. Let's examine myself. I, I, you are Four fulfilled. hours left? Oh my god, it counts down quick. Uh, you, you, you can take the, the thing back. The I want to see what this is. Burger pack. Oh, yeah, because okay. I'm wearing it, right? Yeah. And then you don't have your save, but I don't know if that matters. Maybe I can save right here. Mm -hmm. Oh, I did pick it up. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's... Um, how do you do that? Examine it to save? Or read it? Mm -hmm. Because we've done some stuff. Yeah, no, it's a good, <laughs> good point, point to save. Yeah, and we're full health as yeah. well, which is also good. There we Can go. Can you jump up? Uh, oh, it might spring. Yeah. Boing? No? No. Mm. What is this? Hmm. Just do this to get out of it. I can jump on it, but... It looks like there's an opening above you, too. Yeah, maybe you fall down onto it? I don't know. Hmm. Throw. Cast a spell. Smell. Smell that. <laughs> Cast a spell, yes. Uh, ooh, melt granite. Pass plant. Spell of wounder. Traveled. Hmm. You're further than I got now, I'll have to consult Saturn's walkthrough. <laughs> Magic Fulcrum? I don't know. You feel eight levers return to their original positions. Wow. Oh. That sets everything back to normal. Well, that's something. Interesting. That's good I saved first. I can't. But it didn't change anything in this room. So let's go back. Whee. I like the devil uh, pillars. Yeah, very menacing. Yeah, very but their eyes don't glow, but they are just pillars. So. Come on. Up. Up east. Oh, oh, there we go. <laughs> A little bit sticky. I want to see this again. Can you flip that lever? Yeah. Nothing oh. happened. Oh, once it's gone, it's gone. I think that was a trap, maybe. Oh, God. I wonder what happens if I have the shield now. Do I have something to... You can take your disguise off, but then I don't know if you can get back in that room. Oops. Um, probably not. I think you need to be the ghoul. Oh, a little bit of graphical. Glitching? A little bit there. Not too bad, though. Didn't really get anything in there, did I? Other than the shield. The shield's pretty good, though. But all these... Oh, the bell. Maybe I can... Uh... Ring the bell. Mm -hmm. Watch that cat. Hi. He's looking for treats. What are you doing? What are you doing, little fuzzers? Maybe the bell will get rid of the... Yeah. These games are so obtuse. Like. And then you'll die. You'll yeah. go up to that guy and just immediately die. But I saved way back there, so yeah. it's fine. And we could test out the loading, too. Mm -hmm. And then I think we'll be done. Because we got, we got some stuff yeah. to... Oh, oh, paint! Oh, what could that be used for? Yeah, nothing obvious. Okay, dude. We're gonna ring this bell. Uh throw oh you can throw things. What do you think? The bell? Yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't like the bell. No. So let's load. Do you start with it? Uh yeah. Examine. You start with it, yeah. Oh, oh no. you read it. Sorry, you have okay. to read it. Johnny the WizKid. Hey, got a question. When is the new Gorf game for the Atari 2600 that supports voice Vox going available to buy? Pretty soon. Yeah, but it's not out yet, is it? There's no set date for the new games coming out, but it's it's soonish. Um, Al had to do a couple things. Just watch. I, I made a special chapter for Al's interview, oh my god, <laughs> on Atari Age Day, 
uh, day it's one. Day one, the first interview. And there's a chapter right when he explains when things will be released. It's not a date. It's like a sequence of things he needs to get done. Mm. So let's try it out. Load the game. Oh my god, the loading was super fast. Yeah, very good. So you can't jump on that? No, it didn't spring up. Mm, go back, go back. Thank god for saving. Flip that again. Yeah, maybe you have to do it twice. No, same thing. Mm. Nothing seems to have happened. What was the thing that made the levers all go back? Yeah, magic fulcrum, but I don't think it changed anything. It didn't change any of the movement. So far, things. before this one was announced, I had a hard time comparing the two good versions, the Atari XE and the ColecoVision. Mm -hmm. You're talking about Gorf, I'm guessing. Um, I'm really not up to speed on the XE and the mm. ColecoVision Gorf. So... And that flipping that did nothing either. No, but and there if was I a teleporter. The spell, it didn't do anything though. It, uh, but did I pull the lever again after I cast the spell? Yeah. Let's try that. Well, that just resets the levers. It doesn't the, reset this. No, it didn't reset that. Maybe melt granite. Nah. Mm. I'm gonna have to load again. It's okay. Can no! You read, can you read the bell? Oh, maybe. Maybe there's this. No, mm. no writing. Ooh, don't accidentally save your game. No. Because <laughs> you'd be like, ah! I want to try the melt granite. Melt granite. No, it I didn't might, work. It said you don't have the magic to do it. But I always cast a spell before that. So I had less magic. Yeah, but magic. I think you have to learn something. But anyway. I never had full magic when I cast it. Mm. What I'm saying. Come on, puppy. So it was right here. No, no, no. Keep going. Uh, what else could you use? And I, and the I red. There is the red. Think the shield will protect me from this? No. Okay. <laughs> I mean, you have the shield, which is good, but hey, that guy, Paul. we still haven't figured out what to do with him. Uh, he is spell. awake. Cast a spell. Pass plant. There's yeah, a maybe. tree there. No. Mm. Lots of strength. He's pretty happy. Lots of magic. Food. Mm. He is asleep. Oh, okay. You can't command him awake, but... Uh, what? <laughs> no, he's not asleep now. I think that's what it means. Oh. He is not asleep, so you've, you've woken it up. Oh, okay. Yeah. Help. No. How do you talk? You can give him stuff, but I don't know. Take an object or give an object? Do you want a bow? Uh, do you want a little magic ball thing? <laughs> does he have more? Does he have? Oh, he has a, he has a banana. Oh, you gave him... He didn't seem to like that. Uh, do you want a... Do you want a bell? Nope. <laughs> do you want... A clue book? No, yes, someone has to translate that. Kittens, can you translate the clues? Hmm? Do something silly with the teleport pad and key to wind up in limbo. Wait, you get, gave him <gasps> gave him it? No, I just examined so the, the teleport magic. pad and the key, but that disappeared. So how do you get it back? Mm. Maybe we did need to get it. Yeah. And then flip the switch when we were there. Yeah. Maybe. But do you think? It's too late now. Well, we're gonna have to start from the beginning again. Because it's just get get killed, get killed. Start from the beginning. No, no, no. We'll do it next time. Okay. Getting tired. Oh, sleepies. Oh, I can't go back in. No. Because I gave him the the sun. Ball. It's an inside. You're done. Yeah. You're done. Oh, the sun? You need to thing? have the, the, the paper with you. I thought it was you. the crystal ball. No, you need the paper with you. Hi. Hi. You're mad. Oh, yeah, yeah. I have the crystal ball. Yeah. Give me back that banana. Can I eat it? How do you eat it? You don't. Oh. I think you give it to people who are hungry. 
Oh, you can only drink potions. That's yeah. The, okay. Mm -hmm. Very cool. Yeah. Uh, we made it a little ways. Yeah. Uh, there's a couple a things more. we figured out, um, but examining that crystal ball gave us a hint of what to do next time. Mm -hmm. And it's not to pull that lever. Or was it the second lever? Yeah. I think you want to get the teleport pad first, but yeah. and then and it says pull do the level silly. in the room. Pull the lever in the room, and maybe that's what gets you there. I don't know. Yeah. Um, really great music. Let me just mute that. <laughs> and great looking game. So Very if you're good. into graphic adventures and figuring out really crazy puzzles um, and just trying a bunch of stuff, that is the game for you. For sure. So we'll have to try and progress a little bit more. I just want to play it on my own. I want to <laughs> keep playing it and figuring it out. We, it's we pretty got a fun. couple things. Yeah. So it's thank you, Cyrano, for uh, converting that game. Yeah. Uh, it looks really great. Awesome. The music. You don't get bored of it. It's nice no. and calming in the background. Mm -hmm. um, fun stuff. Chelsea Donut Mouse still here. Yay! So let's take a look at what's coming up in the future for Zero Page. Uh, yeah, come on, come on, come on, go, oh, on, go away. Mad. Notification. Are you mad? Oh, he's mad. He's mad. Fluffy oh, madness. I've been touching him too much. He's, oh. he's so cute. You're so hard not to, not to pet. He's like, no, enough petting. Um, so next show on Friday, we're going to be playing some 7800 games. <gasps> oh, cool. Cartesian Chaos has a two-player update. Is it me or is it? It's you. It's me. Yeah, cool. 6 p.m. Excellent. Tunnels of Hyperion, okay. VHZC's game is is in release candidate, means it has all the levels. Nice. So we're going to try and complete that, uh, which I, we usually can complete as games. Mm. Yep. Ah, uh, there's a way to stop energy draining. Oh, okay. there's a magical way to do that, is there? Um, and maybe another 7800 game if there is one, but I think Tunnels of Hyperion it's gonna take will up take a up a quite a bit of time. Mm -hmm. So we might just keep it to two. And then on Tuesday, we're going to play through the rest of the ABBUC 2022 Very contest cool. entries. And there's some good ones. In yeah? There. Did you, you get will, more uh, games? They're all released now. Excellent. Okay. Binary Parasite, you will love... It's a puzzle game, and it's a really good puzzle game, too. Good. Excellent. Um, Tracks is a great shooter. They're all really, really good, so mm -hmm. I'm really looking forward to that. Then on the 25th, we have the Uno Plus Cart Special with secret homebrew releases. <gasps> what? We have interviews with Marco Johannes and Zachary Scolero, Zach Attack and Marco J. Nice. It's going to be chock full of really crazy stuff really interesting stuff that is going to push the 2600s to its absolute limits like you've never seen it before wow that's, if you think you've seen stuff that's you've a not seen anything bold statement oh it's <laughs> it's gonna it's come a bold through. statement yep um and then we have after that one two three four five approximately six shows until we go on our uh holiday break Okay. And we're back January 3rd after that. All right. So we'll be off for about two weeks. Yeah. Okay. Gearing up, getting all the stuff ready for the awards. The awards yeah. I have to do a bunch of stuff for that, especially mm. the new award. Oh, yes. We're going to have a new look for the award. Yeah. So, um, and Tanya's going to help out with that. Yeah. Yeah. We got to get that. And I think it'll get work. on top of that. Yeah. Yeah. I need to get something 3D printed. That's not too hard. I've already got the design done. Mm -hmm. So I just need to get that 3d printed sent here and then we'll continue on making that mm -hmm. um so thank you for hanging out thank you to cyrano for both the game uh jaguar games we played today great so stuff. so much fun yeah so much fun and uh, we played a lot of 2600 games earlier so thanks for mm -hmm. hanging out with us cyrano chelsea dunny mao johnny the whiz kid yeah, ivory tower, tower collections kev 73 hey Yay. kevin uh rendered ghost um, Danny BC, yeah, Danny BC, yeah, RC seven E, Metal Lunar Seven, Cafe Man Two D, Machine GEX. That's, that's a, a new, ne new name. name. Yep, yep, yep. Old Style, hey, Old Style. Yeah, got some stuff with him coming up too. Yeah, maybe before the end of the year. Oh, cool. Some new games and some world premieres. <laughs> Uh, let's see. I think we're kind of back to the... Are we? No, no, this is no? still... Cafe Man 2D? 
After Dark? There you go. There we go. All right. So thanks for hanging out yeah. with us in After Dark, mm -hmm. playing some new games, longer Longer versions. playthroughs, yep. yep. And uh, everybody have a good week. Yes. And we'll be back on Friday evening, mm -hmm. normal time, 6 p.m. Pacific time. Uh, oh, it's really chunking out there. Oh. Mm. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Arrivederci. Yes, we will you see too. you soon. And uh, we'll see you on Friday. Have a good night, everyone. Bye-bye. Yeah.